Life is like a garden. Life is like a garden. Look at this growth. Now, this is my strawberry bed. I did transplant um, about 20 plants in here. But these are from last year. This is from last year. That's from last year. That's from last year. That's from last year. And those two over there. That's from last year. That's from, you can kind of tell the difference between the ones that are from last year and the ones that I just transplanted. That's a transplant. That's from last year. And so what I'm excited about with this strawberry patch, my very own strawberry patch, is that um, these will spread. So that's my strawberry patch. I just kind of wanted to give you guys an update of what's coming in, what's coming back, and what I've already done. So we have some chives, some three-year-old chives that have been out here. And these are just beautiful and they're delicious. Um, these make beautiful flowers as well. Here's some sorrel that has come back. I have some onions over there. Again, I need to clean out these beds. I haven't had an opportunity to do that. I just dumped this soil today and removed some beds that were out here that were some uh, fabric beds. But um, I said, let me get rid of that because I want this area all in here. This will be, uh, we're going to fill this with rocks so we can kind of sit out here and enjoy the garden and not have to just be in the sun all day long. Um, right here is kale. Did you know kale was perennial? This is from last year. I didn't take it out. I was going to pull it out, but I said, let me, I wanted to see everything I do is an experiment just to see what's happening this kale came back um, I'm most likely gonna pull this kale look at that look at that it's beautiful I'm gonna pull it but I also am going to transplant it and put it in another area on the property and just see how it does with the transplant here's my mint bed and this bed started with three chocolate mint. Here's my chocolate mint. Three chocolate mints. You see how much it has spread. All of that is chocolate mint and it's perennial. It's coming back. I think that's my spearmint right here that has spread. I started with only one spearmint in this bed and that spearmint is going all over the place now. Some more chocolate mint. Here's some rue. Some garlic chives, some chocolate mint under there. And I think down here, this is some apple mint. Look how pretty. Look at that apple mint. This apple mint here. And so this bed initially was my herb bed, and I had a lot of other herbs in here. I had rosemary in here, I had some oregano, but I have decided now that the mint has taken over to let this specifically be for mint. Um, this is another bed I have. I think these were oregano and I'm gonna see if that's coming back. Yeah, I think so. That's coming back. But we do have the time here. Look at this time. This time, I don't think it ever died. Look how, look at this, look at this. I'm in zone 5B, look at this. It did not die over the winter time. This is something I truly, truly love. These are three years old as well. Look at this. One, two, three. This is lavender. Look at it coming back. It comes back and it gets bigger and bigger every year. This is gonna be a big bush by the end of the season. Let's see what else is out here I can share with you. Some more sorrel. I'm gonna most likely transplant these. Some more garlic, chives, beautiful, beautiful. Have some rue. Some rue right there. Let's see. That was some lemongrass that I have to pull up. It got all the way up to here. Beautiful. It was supposed to be perennial, but I'm not sure if that's going to come back. Here's my oregano. 
Look at that. Alrighty, so I think that's all of everything that I wanted to return and be perennial. I do have some sage in the front. There's another root plant. Some more root. I think I have some more. Look at that. Look at that. Lavender. Some lavender that wants to grow back. Look at what it was. It died. And then it came back to life. Here's some rosemary now. What's so interesting. So interesting. No, this is this is this is lavender. So this is my lavender. But you see the dead leaves. You see that? But then look here. Look at that. Look at that. It coming back to life. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. So, this is just the um, beginning prep work to get this back to work. I, um, <laughs> I didn't even see it with some strawberries on there already. I, um, I just wanted to give you guys a quick sneak peek at what the garden is looking like. And... This is kind of like the before and after raised beds and a quick preview of the garden pre-cleaning, pre-spring cleaning and pre-transplants um, from the, uh, look at that oregano, look at that, look at that coming back to life. All righty, you guys, take care, peace and blessings. Life is truly like a garden.